It is a medical school within a cutting edge uh, state-of-the-art engineering school. In my lab, we are interested in how brain cells communicate with each other. What are the mechanisms inside the brain that makes us think, remember, feel, see, hear? We're looking into questions that will change cancer therapy in the next five years. Medical science, advanced technology, and world-class education. This is the Rappaport Faculty of Medicine at Technion, Israel Institute of Technology. Why are the top doctors of tomorrow attracted to the Rappaport? For over three decades, this has been a center of pioneering medical research and education. From new treatments for crush syndrome in disasters, through to stem cell research, on to the world-class science that brought Israel its first Nobel Prizes in Science. At Rappaport, the intimate connection between studying basic principles of brain organization and identifying mechanisms of disease are understood to the depth. Take Dr. Itamar Khan at the faculty's world-class in vivo functional magnetic resonance imaging facility. He is unraveling the connection between organization of neurons in the brain and neurodegenerative disorders such as Alzheimer's disease. Our approach to try and understand the basic nature of this communication is to genetically engineer the cells to be activated by uh, light. In this way, we can see the pattern of activity. We are manipulating different aspects that potentially can slow down the disease progression. Deeply immersed in neuroscience, Professor Jackie Schiller is researching the mysteries of the cortex in the brain, neuron by neuron. The cortex controls how we experience the world, how we think, learn, and how we are able to move. We are interested in studying the building block, the basic building blocks of the cortex. These pyramidal shaped neurons are interconnected in a net, in a web-like structure. And all the storage of information is done in these neurons. We study these building blocks by using advanced imaging, electrophysiology, genetic manipulations, and computer models. Such pioneering medical research is generated by multidisciplinary collaboration, where the top medical objectives are reached through the expertise and support of scientists from across the Technion faculties. It's a unique combination of a medical school that is located in a polytechnical institution. I think it adds significantly to our knowledge as doctors later on in life. The combination of all those different disciplines made me ask additional questions and eventually um, to go to research. I really wanted to integrate uh, basic sciences with clinical work. Biologist Professor Shai Shen Or heads the Systems Immunology Lab, where his team combines experimental and computational approaches from clinical and basic research. By identifying biomarkers, monitoring immunity, they aim to translate biological understandings to medical science. The central aim of our research is to develop human immune monitoring. If a person was to walk into a, a physician's office these days and ask, hey doc, how's my immune system doing? The, there's not a very good answer to this uh, question, despite the enormous importance of the immune system for health and disease. We would like to be able to answer this question at the same resolution or higher than what we know about, say, the cardiovascular system. The primary tool for this that we're using in the lab is the mass cytometer, which is a unique technology available to the lab that allows us to measure the entire immune system at a single snapshot enumerate all the different cell types that exist in a person's immune system and how they're functioning. For Dr. Yuval Shaked, insights into treatment which block the growth of blood vessels bring the promise of new medicines for patients with cancer. He is exploring what causes tumors to become resistant to treatments, using new concepts with potentially life-saving approaches. The uniqueness of our work is that we are looking on the effects of the therapy on the host, which can contribute to the tumor growth. The tumor microenvironment can change the tumor to become resistant to the treatment. Once we make cancer a manageable disease, rather than as an acute disease, I think people will live much better than they live today. And life-saving breakthroughs are everywhere at the Rappaport. 
countering neurodegenerative disease such as Alzheimer's and Parkinson's with a novel drug, Risagiline. Shedding light on how cancer proliferates. Pioneering stem cell research and tissue engineering. Bringing life-saving knowledge in genetics. Unraveling the mysteries of the nerve system. And winning the 2004 Nobel Prize. The discovery of the ubiquitin system within living cells and its role in cell regeneration opened the future of medical research. Nobel laureates professors Avram Hershko and Aaron Chekhanover's research has opened the doors to new drugs for diseases such as cancer and neurodegenerative disorders. We are currently focusing on operations in the system that result in a malignant transformation in cancer and we want to understand the underlying mechanism with the aim at the very end obviously to target the aberration to develop drugs that will prevent cancer. Being in a school in the University of Engineering allows us to collaborate and to generate bridge between the physicians and the needs of the patients and the engineers, those that develop devices. Future medicine that is very much relying on new development in technology will completely rely on this type of collaboration and therefore we are already here. The clinical education at the Rappaport Faculty of Medicine will always be guided by the timeless, humanistic, and ethical principles of all good doctors. The aim and wish to reduce suffering and to save lives. These most impressive achievements are only the tip of the iceberg and have already earned our faculty a reputation for being at the forefront of medical research. The large number of our graduates currently holding key positions within the medical system, academia, and industry in Israel. The faculty is extremely proud of its achievements and worldwide recognition gained during its 45 years of existence, and we look forward to future challenges and successes. Thanks to the generosity of the Rappaport family, the Technion Medical School is able to pioneer excellence in research and education, to open the doors of health from Israel for the sake of all humanity. Thank you.